Alnus voridus green alder is an alder distributed widely across the cooler parts of the northern hemisphere. Topic description It is a large shrub or small tree 3 to 12 meters tall with smooth gray bark even in old age. The leaves are shiny green with light green undersurfaces, ovoid, 3 to 8 cm long and 2 to 6 cm broad. The flowers are catkins, appearing late in spring after the leaves emerge. Unlike other alders which flower before leafing out, the male catkins are pendulous, 4 to 8 cm long, the female catkins 1 cm long and 0.7 cm broad when mature in late autumn, in clusters of 3 to 10 on a branched stem. The seeds are small, 1 to 2 mm long, light brown with a narrow encircling wing. Topic. Distribution There are four to six subspecies, some treated as separate species by some authors. Alnus voridus subsp, voridus, Central Europe. Alnus voridus subsp, Suavolens, Corsica, endemic. Alnus voridus subsp, Fruticosa, Northeast Europe, Northern Asia, Northwestern North America. Alnus voridus subsp, Maximovitsii, A. Maximovitsii, Japan. Alnus voridus subsp, Crispa, A. Crispa, Mountain Alder, Northeastern North America, Greenland. Alnus voridus subsp. Sinueta A. Sinueta, Sitka alder or slide alder, Western North America, far northeastern Siberia. Voridus is classed as an environmental weed in New Zealand. Topic: <inaudible> Ecology. <inaudible> 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 A. Voridus has a shallow root system, and is marked not only by vigorous production of stump suckers, but also by root suckers. A. Voridus is a light demanding, fast growing shrub that grows well on poorer soils. In many areas, it is a highly characteristic colonist of avalanche shoots in mountains, where potentially competing larger trees are killed by regular avalanche damage. A. Voridus survives the avalanches through its ability to regrow from the roots and broken stumps. Unlike some other alders, it does require moist soil, and is a colonist of screes and shallow stony slopes. It also commonly grows on subarctic river gravels, particularly in northern Siberia, Alaska and Canada, occupying areas similarly disrupted by ice flows during spring river ice breakup. In this habitat it commonly occurs mixed with shrubby willows. Topic. Uses It is sometimes used for afforestation on infertile soils which it enriches by means of its nitrogen-fixing nodules, while not growing large enough to compete with the intended timber crop. A. Sinueta can add 55 pounds of nitrogen per acre per year to the soil. Alnus voridus leaves have been used in the traditional Austrian medicine externally or internally as tea for treatment of infections and fever. Topic. See also Alnus alnobatula <laughs>